Check one, two, check one, two, three. Well, howdy folks. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another unboxing video today. I have here the box that I will be opening and you can see the Jamello logo here. I actually unboxed a Jamello product before it was a USB microphone. And this is a different uh, set of microphones here, a wireless microphone. So let's go ahead and get the box open. Okay, so here we go. And let's see here, we've got ooh, a bunch of stuff here. It looks like we've got some batteries. So obviously it, it runs on batteries. We've got, this is our mic drop stuff all over here. This is our microphone. I'll come back to that in a second. What else do we got here? This is, I don't know, is this some sort of mount? We've got some sort of dongle here. We've got, oh, another microphone. There's apparently two microphones in here. And then whatever I dropped, it's like this is another one of those mounting rings or whatever it is. And then we've got some cable here. It's like a charging cable. Um, so I'm not really sure, but they do have the owner's manual. So let me check the owner's manual and figure out how all this goes together. A few moments later. Okay, after reading the manual, I think I know what's going on. And by the way, the manual is not very verbose, but I think I figured it out. So you've got two microphones here. These run on the AA batteries, and that's why it included four AA batteries. So two AA batteries go into each microphone. Then you have your receiver back here, which I've actually got charging right now because it, it was completely dead when I opened it. But um, that's why it has a USB cable. You charge the receiver with USB. So the receiver runs on an internal battery and the microphones run on AA batteries. Um, you have these two windshields or windscreens. I'll take that off so you can see this kind of resembles most of the dynamic microphones on the, on the market. It has that similar kind of shape and, and look. Um, if you unscrew this back piece, you can see right here, there's a groove and that is where the AA batteries go. So let me insert those into this microphone and then we can put this back on. And now it should power on. It says to push this button. Okay, maybe I need to hold the button. Ah, there we go, but that's how it works. Now it's got some other controls here, uh, like volume and effects and stuff. We'll play with that in just a minute after, after the receiver is charged, but that is effectively how it works. I'm gonna go ahead and shut it off. There we go. It does not say anywhere in the manual what these are for, but I'm going to assume based on their size, they seem to slide perfectly right up to that collar there. So I'm gonna guess it's like that, just to give you kind of, you know, if you're holding it, that it makes it harder to drop, I, I, I guess. I don't know, and it came with two of them, so that would make sense because of two microphones. Okay, so let's talk about the receiver end here. So as you can see, you've got this little dongle and it has a eighth inch TRS jack on this end and it also comes with an eighth inch to quarter inch TRS adapter that you can see here. Now we're gonna come back to that in a minute because that's severely limiting, but uh, that said, I just wanna take a look here. Um, you've got one button, you've got a charge port, that is it. Literally, there's no other controls on this, that's it. So it's a very simple dongle. If you push this button and hold it for several seconds, again, it doesn't say that in the instructions, but if you hold it for several seconds, you can see it blinks there. And that is showing that it's ready to pair with the mic. I'm gonna come back to this here. I mentioned that this uh, eighth inch TRS is kind of an odd move. Now, a microphone is mono, right? So it produces a mono signal. There's not two jacks normally coming out of a microphone. A traditional microphone only has one jack. So that means this has, you know, internally become a stereo signal. Um, however, if you're gonna plug it into a PA or a guitar amp or a keyboard amp or something like that, they don't use TRS, they use TS or XLR. Now you gotta find an adapter. Now I'm guessing the reason they did this is because you could plug it into like a series of, you know, kind of, home speakers and things like that. A lot of times they'll have a TRS eighth inch jack. So maybe that's what they were thinking of. So got this little speaker here and the idea is you can plug a smartphone and iPod, something like that into it. Well, I'm just gonna plug this into the side. Turn it on and then we'll grab a mic. By the way, I figured out what these are for. They're so that when you set the mic down, it doesn't roll. And the reason there's two different colors is so you can tell the mics apart, duh. All right, anyway, let's go ahead and turn this baby on. And it should 
Go ahead and pair with the receiver. Check one, two. Oh, okay. Check one, two, check one, two. Now there are some controls on here, like the volume. Check one, two, check one. Oh, that's definitely quieter. Check one, two, check one, two, check one, two, check one, two. Okay, so volume definitely works. It's also got some built-in effects. Let's try that out. Check, Ooh. check one, two. Some reverb there. Ooh, I like that. So you've got a clean setting like that, and then you have a, a few different reverbs. Uh, built in, which that's kind of cool. That's something you don't get with most microphones. And just for the heck of it, let's go ahead and power this one on. Okay. Check one, two. Check one, two. Okay, so it looks like both mics are working. There's without the mics, it's definitely working. Well, one thing I wanted to try here, I'm not sure if the effect is built into the receiver or into the microphone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the effect so you can see here. I went ahead and turn. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's definitely built into the receiver because I turned it on on this one and we're hearing the reverb there. So um, that's good to know. Okay, well there you have it folks. That's the dual wireless microphone kit from Jamello. And um, you can buy these from their Amazon store. The whole kit sells for about 50 bucks. So pretty inexpensive considering you get two mics and a receiver for that price. Um, so while I'm not crazy about the hookup method having the eighth inch TRS, I get why they did that. They're probably thinking that this is more of a consumer thing and these people aren't gonna have PA systems. So they'll be able to plug it into their kind of, you know, smart speaker or something. Um, whereas, you know, to a traditional musician, someone that's going to have like a PA, they'd much rather see a quarter inch or an R or an XLR jack there. This would be really handy if you were doing like, you know, a backyard party and you wanted to have karaoke or something like that, or, you know, just have kind of a DJ to tell people, you know, it's time for dinner, it's whatever. I could see it being real useful in that context. So there you go. If you like what I do on this channel, I'd really appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button for me. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you check out my playlist of microphone videos. I've got several microphone related videos, which are uh, inside the playlist, which is linked in the description. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you guys soon.